to the testing area. The site coordinator shall inform the selected participant to bring a valid form or photo identification to the testing area and to avoid overhydrating in order to ensure a valid urine sample Diluted provision. samples. There, they've eliminated diluted samples. Well, I, I don't... Yeah, yeah. I don't think you can actually drink enough to dilute... Not in that amount of time. See, when... I know when they te- when they test for methamphetamine, amphetamine, I believe it is that stays in you. It, it stays there for quite some time, and I mean, say say you just used, and I believe, and don't quote me, but the levels would be nineteen thousand parts of whatever it is uh, at, directly after use, and over the period of the next two weeks or more, it could be more or less. We'll we'll resume back down to zero if if no other is used. Mm-hmm. Um, but amphetamine is what stays in your system with with methamphetamine. There's there's a lot of things, and I know I'm no, I don't know all the testing procedures. I mean, I just I was just about catching little buggers when they're out on the road. Yeah. So I mean, yeah. when it comes to the chemical te- chemist chemistry part of the testing of the chem. Bleh. Easy for you to say. <laughs> <laughs> the scientific process is sort of associated with the chemical testing. Right. I got no idea other than I know where the what a cup looks like. And, and it's got it thermo- turns this color. And, and yeah. th- there's a thermometer on the side. That's okay. all I know. Well, that's all you need to know. Hey. You know, so yep. um, anything else in that verbiage that, that caught your attention in that? Well, in that I was world? trying to find where it talked about specific drugs they were testing for. Um and I don't see it right off here, doggone it. I know it said alcohol, cocaine, amphetamine, methamphetamine, uh, barbiturates, um, benzodiazepine, and I think is high, benzos, mm-hmm. and uh, and alcohol. Which are the that basically covers anything that you can be abusive with. Mm-hmm. So the major abusive uh, chemicals and alcohol. Um. I don't have any. Oh, yeah. you know, this is something that I mean. <clears throat> when Warren came in today with his paperwork, I mean, he did a lot of prep. Oh yeah. So I, he brought this. This and this is just the drug section that, that their policy they're talking about. It's nine pages long in their rule book. When he brought that out, I said, "Whoa, wait a second. <laughs> we don't have time for uh-huh. that." I mean, I mean, that's going to take off the show. But, but that's okay because I really wanted this is a, a subject that it, it really it matters. I, I do have one more. One, okay. One or two more sections sure. here I want to cover. This one is, uh, I guess it's talking about appeals maybe, but therapeutic use exemptions. Okay, this is interesting. Participants Uh may have illnesses or conditions that require the use of a prohibited substance as treatment. In such case, a therapeutic use exemption may, under strict conditions, provide a participant with the authorization to take needed medicine during competition. This is something that Lauren brought up. I I want to hear this. This is interesting. Uh It's no instance... In no instance will an actively competing participant be granted a TUE, is what they're calling it, uh, therapeutic use exemptions, for a substance that would impair their ability to compete or endanger other participants or spectators. If a TUE is approved that would impair a participant's ability or endanger other participants or spectators, that participant will not be allowed to compete while undergoing such approved treatment. All TUEs will be reviewed by the WRG and in conjunction with a designated medical review officer. In order to obtain an approval for a TUE, a participant must have a well-documented medical condition supported by reliable and relevant medical data. So, wow. doctor's so, excuse, bottom line. Doctor's note. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, you got to have a note from your but doctor. But at the same time. Saying, but they're also saying under no, they're not going to even if, stand for that. Well, if, it, if it's impairing you. Right, yeah. exactly. So, if you're taking... I'll go back to NyQuil because that, that's the one I think Absolutely. of over the counter yeah, that, sure. that really affects people, you know. And, and you know, I, when I was in Marine Corps boot camp, I, I didn't know until after boot camp was over. But there were guys I mean, when it when, when it was time to sleep in boot camp, you you sleep. And I, that man, I I didn't want no part of not sleeping. I wanted to sleep as long as I could. Uh-huh. There were guys th- that came in there, total alcoholics, and they were breaking into House Mouse's locker. This is a guy that hands out all the supplies. And drinking scope in the middle of the night to, yep. get, wow. to get their fix, and they were so evidently hooked, or thought they were hooked, or what have you, to get up in the middle of the night in Marine Corps boot camp and go drink scope. <laughs> man, oh man, 
You know, so there's there's scope is another good example, right? Something you just touched on here, the TUE. Chris Frisbee on, on the Swears Trucking chat line says James Stewart, we know him from the Monster Energy Supercross series, right? You know, the bikes was banned for a year for not applying for his TUE prior to a Supercross race. The TUE was approved the next week, but he still set out a year. You have to apply for it in advance. In advance of testing positive for of, it. Of, Which, in advance of ab- using it. Or, right, or, right. Yeah. Yep. and I agree. Yeah. That that totally makes sense to me. Absolutely. Um, and I, yeah, that makes One sense. One year, so, so the guy's, the guy's, year, the guy's see, taking a chance. He won't get caught. Right. He won't get tested. But now. Boom. Backfired. Right there. And Supercross, they, they set a one-year precedent. Yeah. I'll tell you right now that anybody that wants a TUE is going to apply for it before they, they take a, a positive test because they know a full year, that's going to cost you all your sponsorships. That's uh, going to cost you your living. It's probably going to cost you your career. It probably will. Yeah. You know, now it's someone like James Stewart. I mean, he's kind of the, I mean, he's big time in that, you know, he's kind of the elite writer in that stuff, but it's no excuse. Um. I didn't know that. That that's interesting, Chris. Yeah, Thank that you. is. Thanks, Chris. Um, <clears throat> wow, that's a, that's a all. Full I really year. Have. This was There's... ninety days for Ratliff. This was a full year in Supercross. Yeah, yeah. So it's something not to be taken lightly. You know, I mean, well, evidently the WRG doesn't take it lightly at all. I mean, mm-hmm. what we've seen in the verbiage in their in their policy. And, and I was going to cross reference this with with NASCAR or some other major sporting events and and uh, take weeks events. to do it that. Would, it would, and, and it and we don't have time to go into all that. This mm-hmm. is just. I believe what we're going to see in our future mm-hmm. coming coming to an area near you. <laughs> I, I, I totally believe a you're right. near you. Absolutely. I, I, and I, think and I and I I'm all for it. I, I am too. I am too. There's nothing wrong with testing. Test the media too. Yep. That's fine with us. Well, absolutely. You, it absolutely is. Yeah, I mean, I'll pee for anybody any time. And Jerry, you know. get the cups. You, we need three over here. <laughs> yeah. I, I told I told you last week. Don't tell week Jerry before, that he'll do it to make us his example. <laughs> I had to I had to take a urine test and a blood test. Yeah, like two weeks yeah. ago. You know, and which I know which I passed with blind colors. Table, yeah, at this table, I know that that is not even an issue. Um, other places, it, it is. You know, we're gonna get out of here for a minute. We're gonna take a quick break, and we're gonna come oh, we back do with still? some yes. There's more James Gang pizza beat. So <laughs> Not we're, <much. laughs> we're going to get out of here. We're going to take a quick break, and we're going to come back and talk with uh, our listeners about some news we've got out of Willamette Speedway today. Oh, yeah. And we get the privilege of kind of talking about this first and foremost, and it's going to be interesting. I want to hear call-ins. I want to hear the Swears Trucking chat line light up because this is going to – it's going to change – Things here on the show. This for is the rest the, of the show. This is a game number, changer. Give them the number five zero right three. So call in eight six two three four seven eight five zero three eight six two three four seven eight. Program that into your phones right now. Five zero three eight six two dirt. Program it now because you're going to want to sound off on this one. And in the last hour, we've got two call ins. Okay, that's right. We've got two call ins, and they're going to be good. And uh-huh. we're going to talk and about here opinions. Yes, absolutely, Definitely. and uh, we've got our new segment coming up, the High Octane Diecast Hot Pit, and that's going to be something we're going to have some fun with tonight. So we'll be right back in about six minutes right here on Northwest Dirt News. Archer Floor Coverings has been a family-owned and operated business since 2000. Archer Floor Coverings provides free estimates and specializes in multiple types of floors, such as carpet, vinyl, laminate, and hardwood. They have the entire Willamette Valley covered from Albany to Eugene and over to the Oregon coast. Archer Floor Coverings is serious about their work. They do all installations themselves. No subcontractors are ever used. Come see the beautiful showroom at Archer Floor Covering, 3775 Olympic Street, Springfield. From sales to installs, we can do it all. Archer Floor Covering where your floor becomes our business. Give us a call today for a free estimate, 541-747-2608. Again, that's 541-747-2608. Whether it's new construction or a remodel project, we floor it. Hey, Corey, you want to tell me what we're doing around all these cows? We're at Stumbling J Livestock, Joel. Did you know that Stumbling J Livestock has been a family-owned business since 2005 and supplies all cattle needs from 300-pound feeders to 1,300-pound animals ready for butcher? No, I didn't know that. Did you know Stumbling J Livestock buys any type of livestock year-round and pays competitive prices? No, I didn't know that either, Corey. And I bet you didn't know Stumbling J Livestock buys and sells sheep and goats for pasture and meat. Uh, 
No, I had no idea. Joel, you don't know a whole bunch about cattle and livestock, do you? Well, honestly, Corey, not really. Well, Stumbling J Livestock provides all types of meat from silage fed, grain fed, even grass fed. Yeah, really? Stumbling J sells butcher ready hogs when available too, Joel. I sure love me some bacon. My local butcher, they've got the best bacon. Those local butchers work directly with Stumbling J Livestock, and Stumbling J can butcher at a USDA plant to sell fresh meat straight off the farm. Hey, Corey, how do you know so much about Stumbling J and their livestock? Well, Joel, I read the script. Man, let's eat. I'm hungry. Oh, man, I just found a cow pie with my new boots. <laughs> yeah, I thought I smelled something. Don't worry, it'll wash off. Stumbling J Livestock Incorporated is located in Shed, Oregon. You can contact them at 541-409-5650. 541-409-5650. Does your job, the weather, or your health have you feeling down? Jetstream Aqua Massage is your answer to feeling better. Our hands-free massage will leave you feeling rejuvenated, relaxed, and restored. Our machines will relieve muscle tension and soreness, reduce pain, improve sleep and circulation, decrease muscle spasms, and increase your range of motion. If you suffer from diabetes, you'll be amazed at what our machines will do for your circulation and how it treats neuropathy. Stress, anxiety, depression, and everyday aches and pains are no match for Jetstream Aqua Massage. Our beds will do more for you in 20 minutes than a traditional one-hour massage. And at only $1 per minute, we'll save you time and money. Find us on Facebook, Jetstream Aqua Massage. It's not just a massage, it's an experience. Hi, listeners. Corey Pinfold with Moxie Meeting Promotions and Jetstream Aqua Massage. I want to introduce you to my good friend and Aflac agent, Bo Nileen. Hey, thanks, Corey. I wanted to talk to your listeners at Northwest Dirt News really about the five key benefits that Aflac provides them. Benefits like Aflac policies are deducted on a pre-tax basis, lowering your taxable income. And when you use your policies, your benefits are tax-free, giving you double savings. When you use your policies, Aflac pays you directly, not the hospital, not your doctor. Aflac pays our policyholders more than any other supplemental carrier in the industry. That's more money in your pocket. Aflac policies are portable. If you switch jobs, you can take it with you, so you're covered when you need it most. Over the lifetime of your policies, Aflac will never raise your premiums. Bo, you've made some great points, but the selling point for my family was the value we receive for the premium we pay. We couldn't find this value with any other supplemental company. Right, Corey. For the cost of a cup of coffee a week, you can protect your whole family. Aflac also has policies that cover cancer, short-term disability, and accident, meaning you're covered on and off the job. So, Bo, you're telling me one of these race drivers out there listening can go out and stick their car in the wall 80 miles an hour and flip it, and they're covered? Absolutely. Aflac's always there. For more information about Aflac, contact my Aflac agent, Bo and Eileen, at 971-273-8943. That's 971-273-8943. Or you can find his information posted on Moxie Media Promotions' Facebook page. Bo knows Aflac. Racers, do you want to improve your racing program? Do you want to know the feeling of victory every Saturday night? One of the premier and most successful driving schools in the United States of America is coming to Willamette Speedway. The Brooks Shaw Driving School is coming to Willamette Speedway April 27th and 28th. Wayne Brooks and Kevin Shaw will instruct you in the classroom and on the racetrack. Car setup and driver technique and everything in between will be addressed for everyone in attendance. Pricing for this two-day class starts at $1,000 for a driver bringing his own car through the class, $400 for a crew member to come through the class, and and no charge for a crew member coming to the track on the second day to help his driver at the track but not attending the classroom portion. Wayne Brooks also offers specialized classroom and race tech one-on-one -on -one coaching. The track session incorporates multiple visuals and hands-on exercises at the track to enable students to learn exactly how to improve performance. The track session also includes instructions on how to read a racetrack and how to predict which direction that track will go during the course of a race night. Everyone who attends the school receives a t-shirt, certificate of completion, and a 110-page technical manual. To register for the Brookshaw Driving School at Willamette Speedway, call 870-251-2966. A $100 deposit is required at time of registration. For more information, go to www.brookshawdrivingschool.com. Brookshaw Driving School, development champions from coast to coast. Now back to Northwest Dirt News from the Jetstream Aqua Massage Studio, live on Spreaker Radio. 
Yes. Back for our final segment of the night into our last hour. 